thought beauty was blonde and white. Now I'm 16 and I'm still learning to love me natural. Yes. Still breaking brushes during the process of calming the storm. Beauty has no mercy, does not pick and choose. Who recklessly from any which way. Beauty is a welcoming party for anyone willing to attend. We've been quiet for too long, and the worst type of silence is the one evoked out of fear. We live in a time when black girls grow up thinking they're not beautiful. Every boy that has ever told me I am pretty for a black girl. Oh. I know you've probably heard this poem a thousand times before, but when you break the backs of the unspoken poor, you have to expect a little animosity. Dear Uncle Sam, I won't let you put my face on a t-shirt. I won't let you keep pretending my people are second class citizens. I won't let you keep turning my people into headstones. Graveyards are the only place they don't complain about having too much black people. You'd think we'd slowly become numb to the pain, but no amount of morphine could have numb me to the pain of hatred. The pain my people have felt for quite some time now, all because of the color of our skin. Dehumanized every day and seen as less, and people have the nerve to tell me white privilege doesn't exist. You see, white privilege is not having to worry about your future while my brother sits and wonders if we'll make it to graduation. You wonder why so many black men feel defeated. They never bring girls that look like mama home to mama. Everything they stand for, black men fall so easy when you peel off the queens. Watch how fast the kings crumble. Our color has always made us more back. Things will get brighter. You gotta keep your head up.